Hey guys, this is a video on tree graphs. So a tree graph has two properties. One, a tree graph is connected and two, a tree graph does not have any cycles or loops. Okay, so here I have a couple of examples and non-examples of a tree graph. So first here we have a graph here, Give it, I call it A. Uh, we can see that it is connected and we can see that there's no cycles. So it's a tree graph. Here we have another graph and you can see that it's all connected so it satisfies property one but it's a cycle. I can get from this note here to this note to this note back to itself so that's a cycle. So this is not a tree graph. Here we can see that this is not connected. It does not satisfy property number one because I cannot get from this note here to any of these three. I cannot get to this uh, from this note to any of these three, and I cannot get from this note to any of these three, and vice versa. So this is not a tree graph. So here we have another graph, and it satisfies property one. It's, they're all connected, and there's no cycle, so yes, this is a tree graph. So now we're here, uh, we can see that all of the notes are connected because we can get from this note to any of the other ones. And there's no cycle, so this is a tree graph. Here, we can see that every single note is connected, but there's a cycle. I can get from this note to this one, to this one, to this one, back to the original node. So there's a cycle right there. So it doesn't satisfy property number two, so it's not a tree node. And here, the final one, this is actually a tree graph. Every edge is connected and there are no cycles here. So you may be wondering now, why do they even call it uh, a tree graph if it can look like that? Well, the reason why is because we can rewrite this as a tree graph. So I'm going to go ahead and number this here, the notes 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. And we're going to rewrite that. So we're going to start off with 6, note 6. And we see that note 6 is connected to 2 uh, and it's connected to 1. It's connected to 2 and it's connected to 1. So go ahead and put it out here. And we're going to put 2 here. And we're going to put one here. And then we can see that note one is connected to zero and it's connected to three. So put this out here. We get note three and we get node zero. And then let's see what two is connected to. Two is connected to six, which we have there already. And two is connected to node four and to node five. So we have node five and we have node four and so you can see that it's rewritten as a as a tree so thank you guys and i'll see you all in the next video